from the state today, more than $100 million will go toward developing land, bringing industrial and commercial jobs to North Omaha. KETV Newswatch 7 Sean McKinnon reports on that and the plan to build a city-run youth athletics facility. Sean? For $35 million, this is the space the city plans to develop into an indoor-outdoor athletics facility. The complex will have basketball and volleyball courts, soccer fields and wrestling, a gym and computers for students to do work. At the nearby airport business park, $90 million will be spent to get this land shovel ready. Developers say the way legislation is written now, they cannot use eminent domain to secure space, but hope landowners are willing to sell. The state wants to attract manufacturing jobs and make space for local businesses, but say there's no more space to build in Omaha, so developing this land is crucial in light of we have no sites right now in Omaha. And that is a concern for me as the chamber president and CEO that if we were to go meet with a company, we can't bring them to Omaha because there are not sites to bring them to. The 124 million in investments comes from federal ARPA dollars that the Unicameral converted into state money last year. And change could come soon. If all goes according to plan, the sites could be ready in two to four years. From Carter Lake Park, Sean McKinnon, KETV, Newswatch 7.